since the beginning of time, Earth's precious resource has been separating the men from pretty much everyone else. It takes years to build up enough strength. This job is not for the weak. Now it's your turn. Me? Yes, you. It is the year of the Aquarius. It is your time to prove yourself. All right, so it's only been a week and a half, but I knew this day was coming. So I've been training, working my way up from the bottom. I started with aquapods, I made it to sport bottles, and eventually I made it to the mini jug. But now it's time for the big one, the water jug. And I think all this hard work is about to pay off. Wait, before you attempt the jug. No, wait, it's really okay. You see, <laughs> I lift. Will you shut up and let me finish? There's something you need to know about the jug. Professor Paul? For generations, many have tried to elude this water jug. Uh, it sent home many a uh, bodybuilder crying. In fact, the water jug, which some see as just two H's and one O, is actually made of pure steel. It was the ancient Egyptians who planned it this way. They believed that if you had the strength to lift this steel jug of water, then you will be able to lift it up to heaven. If you have a heart condition or pancreas troubles, I do not suggest trying to prove your manhood in this way. All right, I don't have a heart condition and I'm pretty sure my pancreas is fine, so can I please just lift the jug? Fine. Jeez. Thank you. Wow. So what are you doing right now? I'm about to become a man. <laughs> And I'm going to put my training into use. Yeah? All right. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> it's hard. <laughs> <laughs> yes. All right. All right. Now you gotta slap it. <laughs> Congratulations. Here's your certificate of achievement. You've achieved Westboro TV manhood. I'm going to Disneyland. Really? Of course not. I'm gonna go get water from Westboro TV.